can you talk about, as a defenseman, obviously, the, the, the physicality of the Blues, which everyone expected, but how they were able to maybe sustain some pressure in the game one? Yeah, I, th I think we didn't do a very good job coming out of our zone, uh, especially in the first half of the game, and that, that allowed them to get into our zone, get the forecheck going, and uh, really, uh, really play to their strengths. So uh, for us, uh, we need to uh, counter that and, and get back to, to doing a better job in executing our game. And uh, I think uh, we'll, uh, you'll see a much different team uh, in game two. Maybe you just touched on it there, but in overtime, the Kings carried the play. What kind of changed or what went better in overtime for the game to turn around there? Well, I think you saw us uh, just moving, moving the puck a little bit better, not not spending uh, as much uh, time under under pressure. And uh, when when we can uh, when we get that, those pucks up to our forwards as, as quickly as possible, um, they were doing a good job getting it in and also uh, cycling. You know, you saw a couple a couple shifts there where uh, a guy like uh, Dustin Penner, you know, in the corner really uh, took advantage of his size and strength, and uh, that's more of the stuff that we need to do. We can uh, personally just uh, how you feeling after the nose and things like that. Good, yeah, I'm fine. I was very lucky that uh, I wasn't uh, sliced open by uh, by a skate blade. And th that was a scary moment, like watching it on the replay. It looked like <clears throat> the angle was kind of obscured, but it looked like the skate came up and kicked you right in the nose, but it wasn't the blade, thankfully. Yeah, I think it just barely missed uh, you know, the first one. Uh, so I was, I was lucky there and then just got either the heel or the back, uh, back of the blade, the holder of it, and uh, just uh, broke a nose. Feels okay? Yeah, it feels, uh, it's been broken many times before, so it feels normal. <laughs>